Valencia should have Adra's been working on a project to bring the written Dharma to the Spanish-speaking world. Starting originally with translation work, he soon realized the best way to achieve his aims would be to publish the books himself. Now, the fledgling publishing house, Fundación Tres Hoyas, pioneered by Shudavadra and his team, is well underway. Getting the team wasn't very difficult at all. In a few weeks, I already managed to recruit uh, a number of people who, fortunately, and even auspiciously, had the skills necessary to do the work involved in publishing books. I had a designer, I had a person doing uh, the stock publishing, and I had uh, an agent to work with uh, all the printing aspect of it. And eventually we managed to sign the Escrituras of Fundación Tres Joyas. A fundación in Spain is uh, similar to a charity in, in England. So uh, we continue with our work and we managed to produce four titles, one of which is El Budismo, La Enseñanza y la Práctica, which is uh, the Spanish version for a guide to Buddhist path. So as you can see, the design is quite different. Yeah, the format is the same. And our designer decided that this kind of uh, presentation was much more suitable for the Spanish market. And I fully agree. Then we have what in English is introducing Buddhism written by Chris Pauling, which we call it Iniciación al Budismo. And we have uh, our version of the meta booklet, which is La Meditación, el Desarrollo de las Emociones Positivas. And this is an enlarged edition of the English work. And we also have this, which is El Budismo en Occidente, which is that talk that Bhante gave, or paper that Bhante read in Berlin some time ago. I'm planning to produce probably four or five books next year, which include Suvaja's book, The, the Will and the Diamond, Subuti's book on Sangharakshita, uh, some of Gobinda's work that we have been offered, and we're going to make a co-production of The Life of Milarepa with a publishing house uh, in Barcelona, a major publishing house. So the future is very exciting. Eventually, I'd like to uh, get the market ready to buy uh, canonical work. So in time I would like to be able to publish canonical work and to have as much of Buddhism accessible in Spanish as possible. Uh, so I'm very happy with uh, the current state of affairs and I'm very, very grateful to all the people that in one way or another have contributed to make this possible. And now we can say that there is a bit more Dharma accessible to Spanish readers.